Hello dear friends, this video we will talk about uh, silk design and I will do a lot of blah 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 so this one is not the highest ref definition um, <clears throat> because I want to make it long so get my pencil out oh what happened this is uh, not my pencil Oh, okay. I need to get my real pencil box. Get my pen and pencil. So I will start with just uh, sketching some idea with a pencil. Life is uh, ground, born. This one must be in born. Anyway. <clears throat> So we get some idea out, for example, get a leaf. In only one leaf will not be fun, so get several leaves. And uh, sometimes we get a flower. And flower has heart, like this. And lotus is also a good design. Lotus is very effective and uh, large flower. It's just a, a very pretty thing to do. So just to get some idea out, there is no right or wrong. And today, yes, today in the student art class, we did Zen Doodle. And uh, to my surprise, not to my surprise, to, 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 nothing to my surprise, it's just as I expected, they surprised me again with their beautiful work. With their, um, each student is different and uh, it's just about the freedom. And they are doing so good. And so I am walking, looking through the students' work and for copyright matter, I'm not allowed to show you my students' work, so uh, I will not show you their work. So only myself has the right to see it, but it is absolutely um, inspirational. And I get a lot of, out of their, their work, just so fun to see their work. So let's go to <clears throat> make some design. For example, I want to do a leaf design. So here is the leaf structure. And uh, one, two, three leaves. One cluster, one, Two, three, one, two, three, one. So just do some of this repetitive shape. Okay, and then we put the heart, we use a thinner so that's the leaf design maybe we can put some little fruits or something here and there and you can put the leaf in a, in a, a green color or brownish color green with yellow with brown with red autumn leaf yes oh yes canadian maple leaf so put some leaves so <coughs> make um make your your scarf with this leaf curve this way, that way can be can be a simple and effective design. 
So here I will do just one leaf. So you can repetitively use this leaf design. Okay, and if you do silk painting, you make sure that everywhere is an enclosed shape, so the color will not go out. That's a leaf design. Now we do a flower design. And you can, for example, if it is a long scarf, a long scarf like this, you can put a leaf here. This is a leaf design. This way. Nothing to be fancy and dots here and there can be Good one. What do you think? This is one. And uh, let's do a flower one. A flower. Iris flower. This is definitely not scientifically correct, uh, accurate, but just fun. So when we finish, you just uh, make sure the line is connected. Sorry, I'm doing it too fast, not in the the line is all connected so that you can use it as a design and um, yeah that's about it and uh, put a few lines here so the petal the leaf will be pretty like this. This is an iris design. And uh, if you do a scarf, let's see, here is the scarf. You can do one side like this. Right, on one side. And on the other side, another iris, and make this leaf longer. And um, Let's do some flower petals or something everywhere. Okay, just do circles. Circles is always a fun thing to do here and there. Then this is another pretty design, right? Iris design. Now we do another one. Let's see what else. We can do a lotus design, a butterfly design. How about a butterfly? Here is a butterfly. Oh, this one is too small. I should do it larger.
you can do any kind of the shape to anything, any color. Right? This is a butterfly. So let's see, we put on a scarf. So you have one butterfly here. Butterfly is just one large uh, wing, one small wing. Another butterfly here. And antenna. And another butterfly in the middle. So it's roughly like this. Okay, and uh, here and there, what do we do? We do some lines, for example, as if it is in the sky. So you partition some different uh, color, yellow, red, green, or rainbow kind of color, transient color. Okay, how about this one, a butterfly design? And uh, these are all not so um, uh, not so up to accurate. You you make it better. Okay, just some some idea. Okay, this one we will do a mountain design. It's one of the most simple design. Okay, silk. Its color itself is just pretty. Just imagine each place use different color will be very, very, very good. Sunshine, and uh, here and there you can make some mountain road to avoid the, the painting becoming so boring. And that road goes up behind the mountain, so some parts you do not connect to make it more interesting, right? What do you think? Okay, that is a mountain road design, very simple. And um, now we do just how about geometric shape design? Now we connect all the line. Make sure each line is enclosed. So this is a geometric design with different color. Okay, and this one, these are all geometric shape. And six. The color is not ink, it's not totally dry. I better protect my ink with piece of uh, paper so that my hand do not dirty it, right? Okay, this one we just do circles.
Yeah, circles here and there can be also quite interesting. All these ideas, I think um, uh, one problem is that we have no idea. Another problem is that we have too many, too much ideas. So I try not to bore, not to confuse you with too many ideas. What else? Leaf. We can do a flower. Mm, yes, we can do a perfect flower. And make some line here so that you can do the shading and each line here you can get a darker color right and uh, so <coughs> I will do another large one here no need to be perfect and uh, drawing and finally you outline onto silk is a different thing. The thing on paper can be pretty good, but when it comes to silk can be can be quite disappointing. So just avoid to be disappointed by yourself. Do not be too strict on yourself. So here is the silk design. I am doing everything on long. You, for sure, you can make it into square by different. Okay, so here we have one flower, large flower, and as you imagine, if you have a long scarf, this is around the neck area. No matter you make it re really symmetrically or not symmetrically. Around the middle, there is people who cannot see you. So the highlights, the important design, mostly must be on the on the on the side. So you have one large. This one, yeah, you do not want to show out too much. So make a small flower. How about it? And make another flower in the middle. So make sure at the edge you always have, uh, at the edge you always have flowers. So here we can make half a flower. Here we make half a flower. So flower everywhere. How about it? And a small tiny flower. This can be pretty fun. And with a color background, uni color or rainbow color or a color, same color tone, for example, uh, orange, apricot, sienna color, and uh, let it uh, let it mix, not an even color, will be quite interesting. Yes, this is another flower. Flower one. Now it's already 19 minutes. What else can we make? This one a little bit That's roughly like this. If you are interested, I will send you this design. Uh, if you need large one, just uh, 
this is a these are just idea I'm not so serious on it no I do not mean I'm not serious on it I just uh, um, uh, this is not yet a commercial level product and uh, if you are interested if you want me to become to make it uh, a, a sellable thing I will paint uh, more careful more delicately okay Thank you very much.